guys, Real Strong here. I'm back with another video about Summoner's War. And today, we're gonna be uh, featuring to you guys how good Ran is. So actually, she is the water, I mean, the, the dark, <laughs> the dark Rakshasa. So if you guys don't know, um, this monster was actually one of the choices on the event Hall of Heroes Returns. So uh, the other monsters, uh, let me show you guys what are the other choices. Yeah, uh, the other choices are the Fire, Jackal Lantern, we have the Water Anubis, the, the Wind Horus, uh, the Light Prairie, and uh, of course the Dark Rakshasa, which is a really good unit for me guys. So I had just built this yesterday, uh, we played some RTA units for, I mean RTA plays for this unit, and so far we have liked how good Rakshasa is. She she absorbs attack bar. She stuns and guarantees the stuns if she uh, successfully absorbs um, attack bar. Now we'll we'll uh, we'll show you guys what are the skills that she has, so so that you guys know how you can use this monster as well. First skill is more uh, more likely debuff for attack speed slow. Second skill will be uh, continuous damage and also three times in a row for absorb attack bar. So most basically this unit can absorb 60%. Third skill that she has is a guaranteed stun if ever you deplete a unit or some uh, a monster's attack bar. And yeah, that's a guaranteed stun and I've already tried it. What we're gonna be doing in this video guys is we're gonna show you how good can she be on Guild War. And uh, later on, we'll show you guys the use for Rakshasa or how you can use Rakshasa on R5 content. Uh, we are currently on Conqueror um, rank for our guild. So as you can see it here. And yeah, we're gonna go um, do some wars first. And uh, by the way, I'm still a mid-game player here. So expect um, not too good runes for me. We'll uh, find some enemy to choose and uh, yeah, maybe uh, make more shows for the Dark Rakshasa. So as you can see, we only have um, weak defenses here from the enemy. It, that is because it's still Thursday, it's not yet Friday. Alright, so far we're not getting any good enemies to fight for the Rakshasa. Dark Rakshasa. So we'll find and find. Okay. So I think we're gonna take this, the first one, I guess. What will we do here, guys, is to first um, try to eliminate Fran. So we'll go for the speed lead. So we'll go for Sierra. And of course, we'll put Ran or the Dark Rakshasa. Where is it? Alright, <laughs> here it is. And a friend. So, yeah, a friend. Alright. Alright, so the second round we'll just gonna put Laika, I guess. And this one. And this one. Yeah. Anyways, it's a weak de uh it's a weak uh defense guys. So yeah. Alright, first round guys, so we'll see how good or how guaranteed the stand uh, if ever you, we uh, are able to successfully land the skill 3 for uh, the unit Ran. So we'll try to deplete um, Fran's attack bar here. Hopefully we get a stun guys. Oh yeah, it, it was resisted. All right, so what am I gonna do? What to do? Alright, I guess we'll just gonna first eliminate Fran here. So that we can we uh, can't have any immunity buff on the other side. Slow this one. And uh heals this this uh, the skill too or the absorb. So notice how good it is guys, um, 
for a unit like this. So, if you actually, um, if you are actually successfully absorbing the the enemy's attack bar, then that will like uh, give you more turns for your team compositions, as well as uh, yeah, uh, giving you more chances to win. We're gonna just kill this one. Oh fuck. All right, we'll do this, guys. So we are do we are targeting this one, so that uh, we just can guarantee that it won't one hit Ren. So yeah, we can use her on the other other uh, rounds as well. All right, this will be a guaranteed stand, guys. See. Um, see how the skill tree works for this unit. Um, it's actually always guaranteed stand if, if ever there is there is a 30% attack attack bar left for an enemy unit, then that will be a guaranteed stand for you guys. Alright, we'll go round two. Alright, so we're gonna fast okay oh this one. a win guys so as you know r5 gives a lot of grindstones or uh, legend grindstones as well all right we'll check the grind info so we can get enchanted gem grindstone um, rainbow mons mystical scrolls we can also get shape-shifting stones summoning stones and mana stones so most basically this um, content for the game is uh, for you to boost your runes as well. So what we're gonna be doing is to use Ran for my R5 unit and uh, see if, if this unit will do something good guys. Alright so basically I ran my team for Crow and Naomi as my best damage dealer but since we're gonna be using Ran or we're gonna be including Ran for this team composition then we're gonna remove Naomi since Ran uh, does the same thing uh, like Naomi does uh, with the attack bar um, decrease so we're gonna put Ran here also the good thing about Ran is that it has really high HP or base HP and um, also yeah it has 104 speed which is good for R5 as well so what I did here, or what I uh, uh, read for um, Ran is um, Swift. That is because I want um, first turn, or I want to deplete uh, the boss attack bar as early as I can. Well, I don't know why it takes too much. All right, we're gonna use all the uh, support that we can get here. So we'll get resistance and also um, I think we're gonna just get the defense here. Defense. Alright, we'll get the defense. And of course, since we already have a defense buff and the resistance buff, uh, mainly what we'll just need is either crit rate or attack power or speed. So we'll go ahead and choose Ran as our um, attack power lead here so basically she has 25% attack power boost for all of the units in here so yeah hopefully this works but so far I have, I have already tried this unit for the R5 content and it's actually really really working uh, for my R5 team it is because uh, Ren absorbs too much attack bar that the boss can't even get a hit uh, we'll see here guys
so far we're not taking any damage here and uh, yeah that is because um, Ran absorbed the attack bar it was on the, the first turn that uh, she has uh, she was able to use the third skill I guess all right so this will be the the, the hard part for the R5 content um, after the 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 boss um, HP turned to 50 percent that is actually the time where uh, uh, the boss rages that is also where um, where she throws um, attack power decrease as well as some other e debuffs so um, um, fortunately our units here are well rigged for R5 and also yeah um, they work really well together with Colleen um, healer and also yeah uh, the HP recovery debuff as well as Garuda for as my plans here and uh, of course Ran as the uh, the attack bar producer so as you can see guys the other um, team got defeated already but so far we are not yet done I guess but yeah hope we can, hear, uh, hope we can carry this support team that just died yeah we can guys all right so far Ran is very good doing some damage as well it has uh, contributed almost 50% as a damage in R5 team all right that will be the last hit I guess All right. All right. So far, guys, it's a very consistent team. If you will include Ran as your uh, one of your R five unit, um, one of your R five units for uh, uh, a more consistent Ran. Um, that is because, yeah, that is because. This unit has a lot of debuffs and very good thing is that she absorbs attack bar on the second skill that uh, she may be able to uh, get the second turn after absorbing the attack bar successfully. So yeah, um, I guess that will be all for this content guys. So please, uh, if you ever chose um, Ran as your HOH returned hero, um, don't dump her. She's a very good unit. You can use her on Siege, on Guild Wars. And most uh, especially on R5 if you still don't have Wa or other um, Rakshas a unit. So yeah, um, I hope I was able to uh, um, um, inform you more about the RAND unit guys. So if you have any comment or if you like uh, this content, please don't forget to leave a like and uh, subscribe. And uh, we'll see you guys next time.